You can only see, um, I'm broadcasting us. That's why the way this works is the, my camera's being used for the whole TV show. Oh, yeah, you mean on your, your stream? Yeah, but you're on the air with well, me, so everybody can see me and you. Cool. Okay, nice, nice. Great, man. I'm really glad you called. Yeah? Yeah. Me too. Man. Everybody, this guy has a band called the Dandelion Seeds in Iceland. I want to help him record yeah. and stuff, make a record. Nice. So how, how's the weather in Iceland? Uh, the air was, was just starting. Um, yeah, I think it's just good. Cool. Are you guys going to play for that? Yeah, we're playing uh, next, next Friday. So cool. Mm -hmm. it's, re and, it's really uh, pretty exciting. Yeah, a little bit. It's the first time I ever go to Airbus, So Yeah, a lot of times, you know, people complain. They go, um, like Hokum was telling me that he's pissed because they'll pay all this money for a couple foreign bands, foreigners to play, and then they just expect yeah. Icelandic bands, unless you're Bjork, to do it for nothing. Some bullshit. Yeah, it's fucking like that, and, you know... The every Icelandic fans who you know are not hip or something, yeah. we're just playing at the you know Little lowest bar. budget places. Yeah, at the yeah. At, at Monte Carlo Casino. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, Monte Carlo. Yeah, no, not really. But, I laughed because but, my but, my friend Bjarki played there one day, and I was just watching the old like drunk people just freak out and trip out. <laughs> Or Monte Carlo. Yeah, he played there with his Sweet. organ. He's crazy though. <laughs> yeah, it's really. Yeah. Cool. So I saw Hotberg. I like him. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I like that his name's Hotberg Hotbergson. <laughs> so killer. What do you call him? What do you call him in English? Hashi. Yeah, Hashi. <laughs> <laughs> I miss him. We had fun recording some stuff. Yeah. He's crazy. Oh, really? Yeah. I've known him since Jakobin Arena. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since he was a baby. Yeah. Yeah, we were, we were competing together on the Battle of the Bands back in the year, 2005. Funny. And he won. <laughs> um, I really liked also when he was on... Uh, the Icelandic Music Awards when they were on TV and he just kept, those guys kept, <laughs> like ran off with the microphone. <laughs> what? One time they, uh, Jakob Arena played on the Icelandic Music Awards show. Uh, and the singer, yeah, just, yeah, yeah. the singer just danced right off the stage with the microphone and out the door. Didn't come back. It was so cool. Yeah, it's very cool for TV. But then, you mm -hmm. know, <clears throat> they got that stupid deal in England. So I try and help Icelandic bands out and stuff. And I, I, I was like, you got to come to England and play this show. This will be crazy if you guys just open up. Nobody even know what hit them. You know, yeah. that was cool. And it was really cool when we, pl we, we played it. My band only played once in Iceland. We played at NASA. And yeah, yeah. They were great that night too. Check out, yeah, yeah. I love I that. Seagull Sling also. Yeah, I love all those guys. Um, so I have, I have it one. Is still my... I have one of your songs queued up. I'm gonna play for the, the radio. Okay. But um, in the TV. But we're not done nice. talking yet. I'm. I really okay. hope you guys can come down here and stay at my studio right here. That sounds fucking nice, man. Yeah, in Berlin. Really? Maybe you could bring it's... your ba bring a babysitter. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, we're cool, man. So, have you have yeah? You have been recording in Berlin recently. You know your new stuff, right? Yeah, I was working on a song today. It sounds pretty interesting. It's kind of moody. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. And then I'm taking the new wipe. It's very, very, you know, rough, 
so uh, what's more rough than Sex Pepper? No, sorry. What is the name of the last album? Who killed Sergeant Pepper? <laughs> yeah, 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 it's more rough. I, I like it. Well, now I'm going very, very much. Now I'm going more like. <clears throat> see, I write in more than one style because I believe in art, not. Like, oh, I have to do this, or oh, I'm a poser. I just do what I feel like yeah, doing, yeah. you know? So if I'm doing some crazy, like I did that, I had Krumi fucking sing like crazy metal screaming on one thing just because, um, you know, Aaron, he, he who was recording me, he, mm -hmm. he's, he just asked me one time when we were at Sirland Studio in Iceland, he's like, what would you do with this ooh la la beat, beat from from uh gold frap and i go it's a heavy metal song man we gotta do ve metal viking for the year 2000 <laughs> beyond and then i just i'd never done metal before and we got this 15 year old icelandic guy who's like ingbe melmstein of iceland to do a riff in it and it was just like crewmy you know from menace like him yeah, screaming crewmy. you know just and everybody was like what the fuck did those guys do to anton's head they they possessed him in iceland but I was just having a good time because everybody was like, you know, like the media will be with me. They'll they'll say stuff like, oh, you just wish you were in the 60s. You know, they, they try and say that to me sometimes, like pitchfork oh, or some man. bullshit. They don't really understand I am from the 60s. I was born in 1967, <laughs> so they can suck my butt. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, man. They're just jealous because yeah. they don't get to go to Iceland. Fuckers. <laughs> They just write. They just yeah, talk six, shit. Six. Go ahead. Sixty-seven is my favorite year. Was really. good. There was In some music good music. Though. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Well, um, you know, I want to help you guys make a record, but I'm just wondering if we should think of some crazier name. <laughs> yeah. Because because we should just like take over, get you guys really going around the world and stuff. I don't. I don't know if like if you see like when I look at the this this YouTube that I got, it just says love, but um, you know, with the font and everything and the colors, then everybody's gonna go, oh, this is '60s. But maybe, maybe not. Maybe we can worry about all that shit later. Just worry about recording right now. Yeah. But I'm getting. Sounds a, nice. Yeah, I'm getting a bunch of equipment here. Um, mm. more, you know, and I've got like bunk beds. It's, it's like a, it's like a loft here, you know, okay, okay. S sooner or later you'll see, um, maybe you'll watch the show or something and you, and I'll walk around and show it to you. It's really cool. Mm -hmm. You know, but so I've got like four bunk beds and then there's two couches and I have a, like air <laughs> mattress too. So that's like more than enough for people. But there's so, like, so are you recording? Yeah, I'm recording, but I do that every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have an engineer from France who, who works for me every day, too. So it's no problem mm. for me to say, yeah, I want to make this record of these guys and then just put my engineer to work and then I work more like a producer. I just go, oh, yeah, just make this easy for him. We want to make, we want to make it sound like this. Do it all the same. Make everything sound real. And he would just nice. do it. And he would just be happy for to have somebody playing good songs. <laughs> but I, I really want also to... You know, lights in Berlin. Just in the moment, you know. Yeah, this is so cool. And, you know, I, I'm like a madman. See, I play like 80 instruments. So it's like, I never, I never, I never have no ideas. The only thing that's a problem with me... Is I, I won't work on songs I don't like. When when I'm record <laughs> when I'm recording somebody else, I'll just tell them straight up. I'll go, I don't I, because I don't want to hear something I don't like eighty times in a row, and then lie to myself and other people. You know, because I don't want to talk shit behind somebody's back either ever. So I'll just be like, no, let's let's try something else. Mm -hmm. But that's okay. And the other thing that's weird about me in the studio is I don't, I don't want to argue with somebody. You know? <laughs> you know what I do? I'll go, okay, okay, let's not even talk. Let's not even talk and we'll just do this. We'll do this song twice. 
we're going to do it my way and, you, and whatever way you guys think. And within like 15 minutes, you're going to see like a whole new level of trust. So I, f I find it's easier to record a song twice right in a row, like do two takes, totally different or whatever, than to even explain what I'm thinking to people. I'll just go, okay, you just pretend that you believe for, for just five minutes right here and watch what happens. And then it's just like, whoa. So it's good. It's it's a really good way of working because everybody gets their way. You know, I don't let people argue in the studio if there's a disagreement. Sorry, I know they're they're breaking into our line. That's the that's the man eating trolls. Sorry, that's the man eating trolls from Iceland breaking in. Fuckers, <laughs> those fuckers. Okay, well, um, let's listen to one of your songs, okay? Okay, man. Okay, here we go. This is the Dandelion Seeds. They're from Reykjavik.
TV. We are the radio. All right, we're back. Um, so yeah, everybody, we all enjoy that a lot. So it'll be really cool to make this happen. You know, yeah. in these winter, great. in these winter months, and it'll it'll be cool because maybe you guys can get out, get out of town when it's dark. You know. It's early. No, sorry, I didn't hear it. Okay. It might be cool to do it when it starts to get really dark in Iceland, so you guys can get out of town and to where it's gray. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. But then uh, I just put out Hokan's record a couple months back. He's got a group called the Third Sound, and he yeah, yeah. So that's cool. And then I got Dead Skeletons, which is Jan, Jan Simander. He, he yeah. Nani from Dead. He's doing, his record comes out on the 11th. Was it Henrik with him? Henrik's on, it? Henrik Bjornsson's on that too. Uh, I think that it's very nice record. Yeah, it's, uh, it's know, dark. Mantra. Yeah, it's good. Dark. But, mm. So, I'm really happy that you come by to visit our TV station. You have to do it again. Yeah, I have to learn this, learn how to use this more, well, well, you should just, um, you know, after we get offline, watch the show for a little while. It's pretty good. It's probably, okay, okay. It might be the best thing in the world. It's definitely the best <laughs> thing in Iceland. Actually, I, I have been watching it, you okay. know, just videos. Okay, yeah. Well, we do all you know, kinds nice of stuff. Sometimes, I, okay. sometimes we show live concerts and just whatever. Documentaries nice. like conspiracy stuff. I take phone calls and talk uh, talk to people about crazy shit. I don't know. We just get weird. Yeah, I saw the link you were post on Facebook with the silent, a silent shit. Yeah, the, the face bust. This, yeah, this this fucking hassa dude, man. <laughs> crazy. Yeah. All right, and why? I oh. So let's let's figure out a plan. Enough. About okay. We'll just think about it, I guess. Uh, we don't have to decide today. No. We'll just do it for real. But I, I really, you know, like that deal of, you know, when it's dark. Cool. It works perfect because I'm supposed to be finishing my my record maybe by the end of December, but. I could do two things mm -hmm. at once, mm -hmm. so I don't care. Well, what, what about you know after after next year? You know after New Year. Well, that's January okay. or something. That's okay too, but it might just be it might just be fun for you to come down. I, I'd rather do it. Earlier. Yeah, mm -hmm. we could just do both. It doesn't even matter. You know, then you could write because I have all these acoustic guitars and, and, you know, I have everything here. All you guys would have to do is just get on a plane. You got Luta. <laughs> the only Luta. Th yeah, the only thing I don't have is I don't have a sitar here, but I could get one. Nice, nice, nice. You know, I think I need to work on maybe getting a, an old organ here <laughs> and then we'll be set. Nice. Because I do a lot of programming with my mini moog, so I can make organ sounds. But we we should get the real thing if we're going to make a record. Mm. But moog is also very cool. Oh yeah. I know. Well, I can like make the, uh, no. I can make any sound. So I'm, I've been doing it for like longer than you've been alive. So <laughs> now, seriously, since 1980. Yeah, yeah. It's, I'm born '91, so. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. So it's one of those. Yeah. All right, well, we'll talk soon, okay? Yeah, man. It was great to visit you. Yeah. <laughs> well, Just... Right on, then. Take care. Okay, man. Take care, man. Just visiting. Now everybody dig this. Don't be blue that
happiness will get you if you do your best to see your life. Of the glass you use When you look at things I want to see them Yeah.